This video is about super fast healing by God. It is supernatural healing. It is super duper fast healing by God. If you have faith in God, if you are having I'm not going to say that you have to have a relationship with God in order to get supernatural healing from Him. He may give you supernatural healing before you, you even come to God because He may be trying to demonstrate His power to you to, to show you what God can do and that God is real and that He is almighty powerful and that He is God of love. He's maybe giving you supernatural healing, miracles to get you to come to Him. So healing can, God can heal you from any circumstances, no matter what, what your status is. Um, it all, it's all for Him, for His purpose, for His kingdom and for your walk, uh, your walk with God here on earth. He's trying to get you started. He's trying to grow in the spirit, to walk with Him. God often gives us healing uh, so that we can grow in faith in Him more and more, deeper. He wants us, He wants our faith in Him to grow stronger every day. It is through relationship with God, obedience to God, and receiving supernatural healing and miracles from God is what drives us into deeper faith with Him, deeper faith in Him. So God is going to give you miracles, He's going to give you healing. Especially if you expect or ask Him, ask Jesus for healing. If you try to talk to Him, you call out to Him, call on His name, asking Him, expect Him to heal you. He will heal you. He's not going to ignore you. He's not going to just sit and just watch you suffer because He is so... Jesus is so compassionate, merciful, full of love. He doesn't enjoy when you have pain. He's hurt. He's hurt too. He's feeling for you. He doesn't enjoy you having pain. Whenever you have pain, He has pain too, even greater pain. He wants to heal you. He's waiting for you to call on His name for healing so that He will deliver you from that sickness, whatever sickness you have, whatever pain you have. It could be big or small. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter to Him. Don't get discouraged because if it's something minor, you know, it's not life-threatening. It doesn't have to be life-threatening disease or suffering in order to in order for God to grant your prayer it can be for temporary pain headaches backache toothache upset stomach it can be anything if you have enough pain and you, you want that pain go away or reduced Jesus is going to do it for you. You just got to call on His name. Or in your heart, call on Jesus. In your heart, expect Him and ask Him. Cling to Him to heal you and He will heal you. He's not going to make it worse. Um, His love. Jesus gave me a supernatural, really, He gave me a cool experience in the recent, recent days. 
by the way, I'm a cyclist. I used to be a more like a professional cyclist. I used to ride bicycle with uh, people in, in training rides. I, used, I have a road bike as you saw in my previous videos. Now that I use my bicycle every day, pretty much every day, for work, for grocery stores, you know, anywhere I need to, I need to go. I use my bike as permanent transportation. I no longer have a car. I got, I gave my car away to the bank uh, many months ago. So I have been riding my bicycle all this time now. And recently it happened already a couple of times. Because I exercise very heavily, I ride bicycle very fast because I'm trying to get to place quickly that where I need to go. Um, so I got some pain in my leg, my joint, my hip between my hip bone and the leg joint. Uh, there was some bad pain. It was painful that I it was painful enough that I I couldn't pedal it anymore when I was riding my bike to uh, uh, to go to work or to go home and I had a long way to go now now I ride my bike 10 miles each way one way 10 miles from from home to work and and back another 10 miles uh, and I, that got me worried when when that pain came in between my joint it was hurting so bad I couldn't pedal it I expected at that moment I I told Jesus heal me I mean as if he owed me something I I was expect him like let him know hey Jesus you know you know I got this pain I expect you to heal heal for me so that I can pedal my bike all the way home I got a long way to go I pretty much commended him I expected him out of faith believing in him I, I didn't even have to try because I know it I know it Jesus is there waiting he knows that I have pain and he's waiting for me to say something to him or pray to him or asking him for help. Well, as soon as I told Jesus, heal me so that I can ride my bike. And just one second later, he healed me. I felt this little sharp, like electric, like spark, like sharp quick little sharp pain in one second and that my my pain went away immediately between my uh, my joint between my hip bone and the uh, leg leg bone it was supernatural i knew it was jesus that did it for me i mean it precisely took one second and not two seconds not three seconds it was exactly one second that fast and I was able to ride bike no problem all the way home. Um, and yeah, it's amazing. So the more faith you have, the better off you will be. Uh, you know, Jesus may, may heal you right away. Or he might heal you slowly. It really depends on him, what he has planned for you because everybody is different but one thing i but but one thing i know for sure is that jesus doesn't uh jesus wants to heal you he's not about pain i mean you will go through pain with him uh carrying your cross if you follow him when you follow him there's pain you will have to bear it's suffering but what I'm talking about is healing, uh, you know, from your whatever your sickness or pain. 
uh, you know, sometimes he, 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 will, he may heal you right away. Sometimes he might not heal you to, to use that for fast offering. He, God often use, uses your pain for fast offering for his kingdom. If that's the case, then be grateful that I know it's painful, but be grateful that he's doing that. He's doing that for your interest and for his kingdom, for other people, to save other people. But uh, generally speaking, he, he, he wants to heal you. So if you have pain, ask him. He may do it for you right away. Um, it, it didn't happen only once. It happened a number of times to me. It happened to me before and he healed me. Um, I also had a terrible stomach problem. I had uh, nauseous and, and I was, I could feel like throwing up, but I can't throw up. That's my most painful thing. I, I can't throw up easily like other people can. And God knows exactly what pain I go through. He understands my situation. He knows that I can't throw up. I, and I don't want to throw up. And He can help you with that too. If you expect Him and ask Him to heal you, He will do it for you. So Jesus healed me supernaturally, made the rot, rotten food in my stomach to, to go away without having me to throw up. It was His supernatural power. He can do anything. There's nothing He cannot do. He can do anything. Jesus wants us to have faith in Him, trust in Him, believe in Him truly that He is real and that He is about saving people, saving their souls, saving, their, saving them from pain. Uh, feel free to ask Him. Don't be ashamed to call on His name. Don't be ashamed to... Don't be hesitant to call on His name to heal you. Call on Him and He will do it for you. I wanted to share that. Jesus bless you.